All right, guys, so before we get underway with the main point here of this video, I want to give you guys a brief heads up that my mind has been in a bit of a haze over the last day or so. And to make a long story short, it has to do with a pretty severe and jarring situation that took place in the Antipoke community. Now, this video is neither the time nor the place to get into the details in regards to that situation. But if you guys want a little more context, I will link you to some sources in the description down below. I also will link you guys to my twit longer, which has my official statement in regards to that situation, if you guys are wondering what my immediate thoughts are. So ladies and gentlemen, on to the main point of the video here. We are here to talk about MXR Plays and how half of their channel has been outright demonetized with no explanation. They had actually made a video on this situation to give you guys more details. And in all honesty, I feel so bad for these guys. It seems like that these guys never ever catch a break, you know what I mean? And this right here just further reinforces that fact. And there's some stuff in that video that really stuck out to me. Number one, it seems like that they are going to have to start a brand new channel because of this sort of situation taking place. And number two, all of their videos within the last two or so weeks were just automatically hit within 20 minutes total with demonetization. And the funny thing is, is that those videos were initially manually reviewed and approved for monetization. So how the hell does that even happen? And another thing is that they can't even appeal this. There is no option beside each of the videos that got dinged with demonetization to allow for them to have any form of appeal whatsoever. That right there is more than unfair. And what's even more about all this is that there was no rhyme nor reason as to why these demonetizations even happened in the first place. And that right there just kind of goes to show more classic YouTube antics and their lack of ability to communicate. Like... Do I even need to remind you guys how bad YouTube is with communication? This right here proves it even further. And another thing is that these individuals make sure that their videos are suitable to be uploaded properly with monetization. You know, they have an editor that watches the videos. They make sure that the videos are just straight up good to go. And it seemed like that all was well and good. But then all of a sudden, within the flick of a finger, seemingly, now it's not okay. Okay, like, did they change the rules or something like that? Like, communication, man. Like, what is happening? And from how their video looks, it seems like, at least it comes off to me this way anyways, I'm a, I don't know about y'all, but check me out on this. It seems like that there's that one reviewer of their channel that demonetized literally hundreds of their videos that just decided to give the big middle finger to them, so to speak, and decide to screw their channel over with no rhyme, no reason, no explanation, nothing. Just straight up F you and demonetized, pretty much. Like, what is even going on? Like, if this is because of some policy change, then YouTube, you need to get your ass in gear, and you need to tell us about this stuff, okay? Like, seriously, this type of stuff is not okay. You can't just go around shadow nuking, shadow demonetizing, and, you know, doing things like this to channels that do nothing but abide by your rules the best that they can. If there is a policy change, say there's a policy change. Make a blog post about it. Make it so that everybody is in the know about it. You know what I'm saying? But if it's not the case right here, and it's just a case of someone being a rogue employee and screwing over MXR plays, well, that person needs to be taught a pretty big lesson because that is someone's livelihood that is being screwed with. Like, it's actually crazy the amount of things that takes place on the site and it seems like that YouTube can just get away with it here. And the case with MXR Plays, this isn't the first time that they've had to deal with this type of thing going on to their channel where they were in danger of demonetization or things like that, you know, being preyed upon by Juke and Media. How many of y'all remember that fiasco from last year? Man, this right here really truly makes me feel bad for them. And... I, I don't know what else I can really say. It just, it really freaking sucks that they have to go through this again 
And it's it seems like it happens for no rhyme or reason. And need I remind y'all what happens when your videos get demonetized? They don't get promoted, they don't get pushed out, and the thing is, right, is that that video is pretty much dead in the water. If you get that yellow logo, then you can pretty much kiss your chances of that video doing even remotely decent. You can kiss all that goodbye. And all for what? Because YouTube is sleeping on the job? They say that one is okay, and then a couple weeks later, they decide to change their mind, but oh, that's not okay. You know, this whole wishy-washy bullshit here? Like, that, that stuff can't happen. Like, that stuff doesn't fly here. If you're gonna make rules, make rules. Make them concrete, okay? Don't just make these rules, and then make these changes as you go along, and go back on what was originally okay, and punish people all because they were following your rules and guidelines, you know? In the case of MXR Plays, half their channel, you know, the backlog and stuff like that got demonetized. So it was a retroactive demonetization, which means those videos that were originally okay, now all of a sudden they're not, you know? Like, that just goes to show how messed up this whole this whole thing is. So I'm not really sure what else I can say here at this point. Uh, I'm going to end things off here if that's the case. Uh, it's a pretty hard video to watch, especially towards the end. Um, there's some tears involved, so if you guys are fans of MXR Plays, they definitely need your guys' support here and now. Um, I will link you guys to the video in the description down below if you guys want to have more context filled in. Then that is definitely the video for you guys to watch. So with that being said, Rom, thank you for bringing this to my attention, and I hope you guys have yourself a damn good one. Thank you very much for watching. Also, thank you guys for your time as well, and I'll see you guys in the next video.